we greet our dear andunulapam readers in the mighty name of the lord jesus it's 9th of november the thursday year 2023 today let's meditate on the topic mind of conscience they show the work of the law written in their hearts that conscience also bearing witness and between themselves their thoughts accusing or else accusing them for the book of romans chapter 2 verse 15 god has placed conscience inside every person irrespective of the religion they follow that is the voice of god and this conscience judges every thought and action of a person when he commits sin he is pricked by his conscience and even without his knowledge there is a hesitation to commit sin those who know christ will be judged according to the word of god but those who do not have any knowledge of christ will be judged based on their conscience in the day of white throne judgment the good and bad aspects of everyone's life will be opened like a book conscience will judge him and either accuse him as guilty or excuse him as guiltless a servant of god on his mission to african continent found that there was no equivalent term in their language for conscience but when people spoke about it they referred to it as three pronged triangular sword according to their belief when a man sins a triangular sword starts spinning in his heart when the man commits a grave sin it spins at high speed stabs and tears the heart but if he continues to sin the sharpness of the sword is reduced and becomes dull it is their belief that a man continues in sin by stifling his conscience when a man sins his conscience wails so loudly and it says to the man do not ruin your soul by committing sin when peter cursed and denied the lord a sharp sword pierced through his heart when judas iscariot betrayed lord jesus for 30 silver coins the triangular sword pierced through his heart when a man sheds tears for his sins when he confesses his sins and comes unto the lord with a repentant heart then he is saved but when he surpasses his conscience his heart is hardened when apostle paul preached the word of god those who heard him were cut to the heart and said sirs what must we do to be saved and this led them to salvation in christ only the blood of jesus christ can cleanse the conscience of a man man will never have peace in his heart till he confesses his sins but how much more shall the blood of christ who through the eternal spirit offered himself without spot to god cleanse your conscience from dead works to serve the living god from the book of hebrews chapter 9 verse 14 verse for further meditation from the book of proverbs chapter 28 verse 13 he who covers his sins will not prosper but whoever confesses and forsakes them will have mercy today's bible reading meditation for morning from the book of jeremiah chapter 46 and chapter 47 bible reading for the evening from the book of hebrews chapter 